Hey yo. Welcome back to another episode of Successfully Failing TV. I know it's been a while since I've done not not a while, it's been a couple days, maybe a week that I've done any Pokemon stuff, but we got our hands on two very cool items. We have the Mewtwo V Union box and the Zacian V Union box. We're just missing Greninja. We're not that cool. But excited to get our hands on these they both come with evolving skies chilling rain vivid voltage and sword and shield booster packs along with these uh new v union cards and it comes with a jumbo v union cards cool conversations in the back so yeah um before we get into this if you guys are not following me already you can find me on instagram and you can follow me on the tiktok at I am Danny Darko. So like I said, we, we got Zacian and Mewtwo. We're missing Greninja. Hopefully we get our hands on that soon. But let's just jump right into this. So we're gonna start with the Zacian box. I'll, I'll go a little slow with this because maybe some of you haven't seen this yet. So it comes with, like I said, the four cards. So pretty much what you're doing is the goal is to get all four of these cards in play. You have to have all of them in your discard pile and then that's how you're able to play them I believe and put them onto your bench or something. I'm wondering if if the uh, cards are actually going to be in play at, you know right away on TCG Online. <coughs> Evolving Skies, Chilling Rain, and Vivid Voltage. Let's organize this. Then we have our Jumbo card. So our Jumbo Zacian V Max card. Pretty sick. It's nice to actually have like a full big card of this. Professor Burnett, bottom left, bottom right, top right, top left. I wonder what that guy's talking about. We'll keep the big one in the back. If you guys haven't peeped, this is my my first edition base sand true. Alright, and let's open up the Mewtwo. Honestly, I'm not a fan of the the uh English packaging, but this right here. Eh. Okay, let's get these out. Code card, I'm keeping that because I'm gonna use it. We got our second Professor Burnett. I'm actually surprised they didn't make it like at least holographic, but it is what it is. Whoa! Mewtwo, bottom left, bottom right, and then the top. I'll show you guys the uh, full jumbo card so I don't have to do that whole putting everything together like a puzzle. We got our, whoa, we got our booster packs. Same four as the other one. So let's get right into the pack. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna open up Vivid Voltage first, cause that's probably my least favorite. We'll do Chilling Rain second, Sword and Shield third, and then Evolving Skies last. And we got my boy Drow down. Yes, excited. Eh, whoa. Have you guys picked up any of the V-Union boxes yet? I, I honestly want to get my hands on the Japanese one just because um, I've seen videos where people were opening up the booster packs and it's not really anything. They didn't really get anything crazy, but still like the Japanese setup. It's a lot more compact. Whoa, one, two, three, four. It's a lot more compact. Psychic Energy. Nuzleaf. I'm not going to really stick around too long with these cards because you've seen them time and time again we got a Wismer reverse hollow and a Terrakian our second vivid voltage and just if you guys are wondering code cards I keep them I actually play the game online and there are some cards I'm actually trying to get there so I do have chase cards there we start off with another psychic energy Bat. A reverse hollow weedle and a shift tree to be honest i'm not expecting to pull anything crazy in these booster packs though i have seen people pull pretty cool stuff but i think for me i'm just excited to have these and have the uh v union cards especially my dude mewtwo if i wasn't able to um get my hands on multiple i would have just got mewtwo um at least that would have been my first choice all right, we're on to Chilling Rain right now. This will be our first Chilling Rain pack. Uh, uh, Ice Rider Calyrax and my dude in the background having some deep conversation. 
One one day those conversations are gonna get me like flagged or something. I don't know, or reported. Just just um, disclaimer. I don't agree with anything they're saying. I think we got something back there. Uh, cool. The obligatory siren in the background. I don't think there's been one episode, uh, one episode on this channel that I have not heard, um, that we have not heard an ambulance in the background or some kind of a police car or something. Okay, so poke, we got a reverse hollow Caitlyn and oh, oh yeah, we got a gold trainer card. I don't know if this is any good. Put a basic Pokemon from your opponent's discard pile onto their bench. I guess that's good if you have one of those, um, cards that, uh, do more damage for every Pokemon on your opponent's bench. But we got another gold card. I've always been saying how much I want more gold cards in my collection. So this would be, I want to say number three. For some reason, I start my videos and I forget to take out the sleeves. So yeah, we got ourselves a Echoing Horn. Let's put you back here for now. If you're not subscribed to the channel, please do. Um, if you're not subscribed to me on social media, please do. I am Danny Darko on Instagram and TikTok and Twitter if you guys are into that. But I will be posting some new um, some new record videos soon. And I think we got another hit, guys. I, no, actually, no. I'm probably wrong. Anyways, Fighting Energy. So, yeah, we got um, we got some records that I'm going to show off to you guys later on. New uh, Persona 5 Royal um, vinyl set. And got some Halloween records to show off. So, we have ourselves a Reverse Hollow Rare Golurk. It's my dude. Holographic Tauros. Now we're on to Sword and Shield Packs 1 and 2. And then we get to Evolving Skies. The thing I'm most hyped to open up. But before I get into that, let me show you guys something. Yeah. These beautiful cards. So we have Chikorita. We have Cyndaquil. And we have Totodile. Let's jump into the Sword and Shield. We've got Zamazenta. Keep your fingers crossed that we actually pull um, the uh, Snorlax VMAX. Rainbow, non-rainbow, who cares? That's, that's definitely a card we want to get. It's one of our, our chase cards in this set. And I think I think there's a Marnie in here, if I'm not mistaken. So that would be cool. Okay, four. And we're still we're still looking for that Umbreon in Evolving Skies. So maybe today is the day. We have a Reverse Hollow Ball Toy and a Gengar. Cool. All right. So we are on to our second Evolving... I mean, um... Sword and Shield set pack. Sorry, one, two, three, four. Yeah, that guy is just still going. It's funny because literally, before I was recording, it was silent outside. We have a Reverse Hollow Hitmonchan and a Raichu. Cool. Don't have this card. I think that's gonna go to Kayla. All right, now on to Evolving Skies. So we haven't really got anything crazy in, in these uh, boxes. I do have another Mewtwo. I'll probably end up opening it up anyways, who am I kidding? But um, I really wanna try to keep that one preserved because it's Mewtwo and I think it looks really nice. So I, I attempted to keep the Calyrex sets unopened, but I got greedy. All right, so we have a one, two, three, four. So let's keep our fingers crossed. We want that Umbreon. I think something's back. Yeah, something's back there, yo. Oh, man. How sick would it be if we get an alternate art? All we're missing from Evolving Skies, as far as Rayquaza goes, is the VMAX alternate art. So if we pull that, that'd be, like, wild. I never really thought going into that set that Rayquaza would be the one that, essentially, I would end up trying to finish off the collection. And here we are. Reverse Hollow Stormy Mountains. And... Oh, shh. I think this is a... Okay. Like and rock and roll. Nice. So now all I'm missing is his regular VMAX. So let's put you in a sleeve. I'd really be excited if I got Garbodor. On to our last pack. Let's see. Can Evolving Skies do it again? I got psyched, though. I thought it was an alternate art kind of had this like sylveon vibe going but it wasn't it wasn't sylveon okay um four to the front blah 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 we have a fire ng wow look at that centering wild bottom heavy yo nuzleaf whoa get that in frame skip loom really good card that 
all three of them. Low Tad, Teddy Ursa, Reverse Hollow Lilligan, and a Rare Marshadow. Check this out. So we have a Rainbow Rare Lycanroc, and we have a Gold Echoing Horn, and then we have the four Zacians and the four Butus, and then we got the big cards. You know what? F it. Could always buy another one, right? We're gonna open up the other Mewtwo. All right, so I'm not gonna bother showing you guys the Mewtwo. We're gonna get right into the packs. I knew I was gonna do this, man. Same thing, Chilling Rain, Evolving Skies, Vivid Voltage, and Sword and Shield. Let's see. Who knows, maybe we'll get something sick though this time around. Sick Er, we got a rainbow and a gold card, so I'm happy about that. Trubbish, my dude. I'm putting that to the side, because I love him. And a Dreadnought. Let's do Sword and Shield. Yeah. So if you're liking this, make sure you guys hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, blah, blah, blah. Share it around with your friends, especially if I pull something cool. I don't know if the rainbow and the gold card warrant some shares, but that would be cool. We have a reverse hollow diglet and a stone journer. As far as like the sword and shield set goes, like all the expansions and whatnot, I don't think I've really been hyped for any other one than other than um, Evolving Skies. That's hands down my favorite. So much shit in there. All right, we have a Fighting Energy. Yep, there you go. More Sirens for you. Galarian Farfetch'd and a Binette. We have Umbreon. Will we get you? I'm actually mad I opened this up. I am very mad. <laughs> Should have just kept this one sealed, but hey, maybe I'll get my hands on some more. I still need Greninja, so there's that. So maybe, you know, I see Greninja and Mewtwo laying around. I'll pick those up. Um, we have a Psychic Energy, Dream Ball, Stormy Mountain, Baldor. I think we have something, guys. I hope it's not just the shitty edge that makes me think we have something. So this is a uh, Moon and Sun badge, Reverse Hollow, and no, it's just an Entei Reverse. I mean, regular Hollow. All right, so that was that. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, hopefully, I could get my hands on the Greninja soon, so I could show that off. It would be, I mean, you know, it makes sense finishing off the collection. But if you guys are not following me on Instagram and the TikTok. You can find me at I am Danny Darko, and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.